Hello students, welcome to Lido homework. In this video we are going to solve the question that you see that without adding we need to find the sum of the given numbers that are there. Now um, we know that if we have to add a given set of consecutive odd numbers the formula used is n square where n is equal to number of digits or odd digits that are added okay so let's um, look at it one by one now in the first question I have one three five seven nine all are odd numbers so I can use this formula n square and how many odd numbers are there one three five seven nine 5 right so for the first case my n would be equal to 5 and the formula I am using is n square which is nothing but 5 square which gives me 25 that means 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 9 will give me 25 let's move to the second one now in the second question also I can see all our odd numbers so this particular uh, formula will stay true how many odd numbers do we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 odd numbers so n for the second case would be 10 the formula I'm using is n square so n square is 10 square which is nothing but 100 so the answer for the second question the addition of all the numbers that are given 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 9 plus 11 plus 13 plus 15 plus 17 plus 19 oh that's a long string is equal to 100 right let's move on to the third one now that is a really long string up to the odd number 23 but we need to find the value of n right so let's count how many digits are being added so we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 and 12 so n in this case would be 12 the formula I'm using is n square that means it's 12 square and if you've kept practicing by now you know 12 square is 144 if you still find it difficult go ahead do 12 into 12 solve it 2 2's are 4 2 this goes blank over here you have 2 and 1 4 4 1 so the answer over here is 144 so the answer for the third string of numbers the addition that is there for that is 144 that's all in this video please feel free to like share and comment and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.